this cause we the real life, real life, real life, real life. What's going on everybody, it's Fat Track. In this simple tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to get your drums to knock on an MPC 2000 XL. At least how I do it. It's very simple. I understand that the newer MPCs, they, they're geared towards workflow. However, I'm with EA Ski. I'm geared more towards sound, sound quality. The workflow may be tedious on an MPC 2000 XL, 4000, even ASR 10. However, that sound you get, it's worth it in the end. So this is geared towards producers who have an older MPC or just one MPC, whether it be a 2000 XL. In this case, this is for you. Follow me on this tutorial. I'll show you how to get your drums to knock every time. Right on, so I have a whole bunch of drum sounds in each pad bank. I know that I want to stack this and this together. So instead of hitting them both at the same time, my kit on drum three, Booney Mayfield drum kit, this is a long time ago, like 06. So drum three, shift six, shift program drum three. I'm in pad bank B. So I'm hitting pad 13 and 14. What you want to do is you want to hit one pad and go down to where it says normal in your mode and go over to simultaneous and I'm gonna stack pad 13 with pad 14 so and you have two pads you can stack per one you know what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn our wheel to the right and we're gonna find B14 <clears throat> so if you notice when I'm turning to the right we're looking for pad B14 and I'm not sure how the Akai does the method of lettering and, you know, all that. I haven't researched all that. However, I'm looking for B14. There you go. So, pad bank B13 is going to trigger B14. So, boom. We turn it off. You know, go back and find it again. Come on, B14, where you at? Boom. You know, you can go into your params and you can actually tune it down and however you like. That's how you stack with an Akai MPC 2000 XL. Let's say you wanted a, uh, let me see. Pad A3, I'm hitting A3, so the same thing. So drum three, so shift program. Drum 3 is my program, and I want to do pad A3 with A8. So, I'm going to go down. I'm going to hit pad A3. You'll notice pad A3 here. And I'm going to stack it with pad A8. And you go back down to simultaneous, and then we'll find pad A8. You can go to our params and if you wanted to, then that sounds like a gunshot. That's crazy. Take our tune to regular. You know, bring it down. You know, so that's how you do it. Hope you learned something.